Oh my god, what is that? Are you sure this is a lamb? <laughs> oh. Holy crap! I know the best <laughs> oh my god. lamb today. Are you sure it's not a dog? <laughs> <laughs> กินตามลุงนะครับวันนี้ผมอยู่ที่ห้องอาหารอียิปต์นะครับอาราเบสนะครับอยู่ในซอยคุณวิซอยสองนะครับเห็นไหมไม่ได้มาคนเดียวนะครับผมมากับน้องบูมครับสวัสดีค่ะยังไงฮะอิ่มจากตลาดน้อยมาแล้ววันนี้มากินต่ออาหารอียิปต์นะไม่เคยมาเลยค่ะครั้งนี้เป็นครั้งแรกที่มูจะมาลองทานอาหารอียิปต์ตื่นเต้นมากแล้วเรามีคนที่มีประสบการณ์กับประเทศอียิปต์ด้วยครับเขาคืออังเคิลแกรมสวัสดีครับอังเคิลแกรมนะครับก็เป็นก็เป็นเพื่อนผมตั้งแต่สมัยเรียนปริญญาโทนะตอนนี้เขาเคยอยู่อียิปต์มาแล้ว4ปีนะครับเดี๋ยวเรามาคุยเรื่องราวเกี่ยวกับอาหารอียิปต์ในความประทับใจของอังเคิลแกรมกันครับ All right I do Graham. You've been in uh, Egypt for four years. Four years, yeah. Four years, and yeah. moved to Thailand. I've been here since September, so it's five, six months. Five, six months, and boom! Have you ever tried Egyptian food before? No, it is first time. time. First time, yeah. <laughs> Anything to recommend? Koshery. Koshery is. What is koshery? Koshery is a carb overload. Carb overload. It's, it's good it, for diet. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Not really. No. <laughs> It's a great for winter food in Egypt because a lot of people imagine Egypt being really boiling hot, but in the winter it does get quite chilly. So something that to, to fill the belly on a winter, cold winter's day is great. Okay. okay. Anyway, it's gonna make me fat. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> we can pretend it's winter. <laughs> uh, koshery is a mixture of uh, pasta, rice, lentils. It's got some spicy tomato sauce that goes on top with fried onion. Oh, listen to it. It doesn't feel good. <laughs> How is it very good? How about the life in uh, in Egypt? I loved it. It's I loved it. The, the Egyptians are really sweet people. Um, and you test that, them? Hmm? You test them? Uh, yeah, several times. <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't eat a whole Egyptian though. Um, but they yeah they're really really. Um, Friendly people, and they really are hospitable. <laughs> um, so, um, a lot of people, when, when you go into the shop, if people are eating at the back, you'll have a group of people out of sight. And when they see you walk in, straight away, come over, come over, and come and come and join us. Every single shop you go into, so oh. you can go out shopping, and you end up coming coming away just eating at every <laughs> shop you go Visa? into. Yeah, they just offer. Off, it's like there you go, um, <laughs> and you just can't. You have to sit. You know, you can't help but sit down and just tuck in. It's great. Oh, sound like heaven. <laughs> <laughs> um, There is one uh, speciality which uh, <laughs> lots of people quite find quite funny. A lot of people think it's a joke. It's called the Viagra sandwich. The Viagra sandwich. <laughs> Viagra sandwich. Viagra sandwich. <laughs> yes. In Egypt. Yes. Vegetarian. <laughs> 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 that is true. What is that? Um, so it's basically a sandwich with crab sticks, uh -huh. uh, calamari, uh -huh. prawns, everything seafood. Uh -huh. It's just crammed full of seafood. Uh, and I guess because they say seafood is an aphrodisiac, that's why they call it the Viagra oh. sandwich. That's true. That's true. It's a Boom, have you ever tried? I want like seafood or Viagra. <laughs> <laughs> 
How okay. are you today? Great, great. Everything okay? Yes, everything great. Yeah, nice to see you at our office restaurant today. Yeah. Keep you something special, okay? But I will show you later. Okay, okay? thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. คือจริงๆต้องบอกท่านผู้ชมนะครว่าร้านนี้นะครับอาราเบสเนี่ยนะคำว่าอาราเบสเนี่ยมันมาจากคําว่าเนี่ยรวดลายอย่างเงี้ยนะโดนกําแพงเนี่ยเราเรียกว่าอาราเบสนะฮะและคําว่าอาราเบสยังเป็นท่าเต้นบัลเล่ด้วยนะท่าที่แบบเต้นแล้วยกขาไปข้างหลังนะโอ้ว้าวว้าวว้าวว้าวว้าว Are you sure this is a lamp? Yes. Oh. I will do the best. Oh my god. Lamp today, really great. Is it the whole lamp? Yes. Oh, too big, ma. We will marinate. Too too. Never seen it. Our Arabic sauce. Oh my god. We have it. Boom. Yeah. This is what we have. We have to see it. This. It's a common sight in the butchers, in the shops, but I've never, it's a first in a restaurant. <laughs> yeah, I I'm, not, I'm looking forward to seeing table, how, like how it's prepared though. You will never see like this. Holy at Arabic. Oh, that's it. So what is this? It's our special. Is it, uh, is it yogurt based? Or, yeah. yep. Mm. Yogurt, olive oil. Olive oil. Olive oil. Olive oil. Olive oil. Yeah. Actually, we have to do the marinade and leave it like four, five, six hours. Mm -hmm. If mm -hmm. more, it's be good. Yeah. Oh. Okay. But we already we will we will marinate and we will leave it like five, six hours yeah. and then we put it out. Yeah. Okay. Oh. So today we need to wait for five, six hours no, before I, you. I have some. I have. Oh, okay. I will do already for you. Okay. Okay. <laughs> แกะทั้งตัวเลยค่ะคืนนี้จะนอนหลับไหมเนี่ย Are you sure it's not a dog? Molokaya. Molokaya. Oh, wow. Oh, smell nice. เออกินกระเทียมนะโอ้ว้าวส่วนเนื้อกรีนลิฟส์เราเรียกมันลูกเฮียมันลูกเฮียใช่แล้วเราใช้กระเทียมเล็กๆแล้วเราใช้น้ำมันแล้วเราใช้น้ำมันแล้วเราใช้น้ำมันแล้วเราใช้น้ำมันแล้วเราใช้น้ำมันแล้วเราใช้น้ำมันแล้วเราใช้น้ำมันแล้วเราใช้น้ำมันแล้วเราใช้น้ำมันแล้วเราใช้น้ำมันแล้วเราใช้น้ำมันแล้วเราใช้น้ำมันแล้วเราใช้น้ำมันแล้วเราใช้น้ำมันแล้วเราใช้น้ำมันแล้วเราใช้น้ำมันแล้วเราใช้น้ำมันแล้วเราใช้น้ำมันแล้วเราใช้น้ำมันแล้วเราใช้น้ำมันแล้วเราใช้น้ำมันแล้วเราใช้น้ำมันแล้วเราใช้น้ำมันแล้วเราใช้น้ำมันแล้วเราใช้น้ำมันแล้วเราใช้น้ำมันแล้วเราใช้น้ำมันแล้วเราใช้น้ำมันแล้วเราใช้น้ำมันแล้วเราใช้น้ำมันแล้วเรา And uh, very delicious, of course. Some people like to put more garlic. Some people don't like to put garlic at all. I hope the garlic is okay. Yeah, yeah this, it's very good. Garlic is very good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and mainly it's made with a soup from um, chicken or meat. Mm -hmm. Chicken broth. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So bon appetit and enjoy your your. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Hui. Aloy. Plenty of flavor. Yeah. Aloy. Aloy. Hmm. Yeah. Aloy. Aloy. Hmm. 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 อันนี้เชฟพามาดูที่เตานะฮะ as well Egyptian bread อ่าฮะอ่าฮะ good see now nice nice you found the Egyptian pizza oh stuff it with cheese stuff it with with lamb chicken Lamb. Lamb mm. close. We come back after three hours. Okay. Okay. Ah. We come back with falafel, Egyptian falafel, 
อนี่คือฟาลาเฟลนะฮะไม่ใช่หมูทอดนะครับเหมือนแฮมเบอร์เกอร์เหมือนแฮมเบอร์เกอร์ so one mix mazza mix mazza is have four five things for mix salad you can try everything in one plate we have a hummus chickpeas with sesame sauce with some olive oil t a t i n a sesame sauce with olive oil garlic sauce and we call baba g a n o k is egg blend with uh, green pepper red pepper some onion we mix together with some spices with some olive oil and b o m a g a n o sauce last one is the m u t a b a l is sesame sauce with the egg blend barbecue We mix together and then we mix it with some spices and then we put on the top like o l i v e oil and then we eat we eat it with some Egyptian bread. Enjoy. Ah, l o n g p a m a l e l It's m o r e But you have to take care because it's too hot. No? Oh. Oh, the team. <laughs> <laughs> อ่ะบูมหนุนนอนโอ้ยฟันฟันไอ้สติลที่ฮอตสอรี่เขาเรียกว่าฟลัตเบรดแต่ไม่ใช่ฟลัตคุณต้องเรียกว่าพิลโลเบย์ฮูมัสฟิร์สอ่าฮูมัสอืมอืมอืมอ่าน้องบูมน้องบูมไม่เคยกินน้องบูมต้องลองลองลองอะไรเลยอุ้ยร้อนอันนี้ก่อนใช่ไหมอันนี้ทำจากชิคพีถั่วลูกไก่เป็นไง It's really creamy. Creamy. And it's probably a good idea as well to eat the falafel with hummus with um, a bit of salad. But before I do, I'm just going to try it by itself. See, that's how you can tell the Egyptian falafel when it's green inside. It means it's made with the broad beans, not chickpeas. Mm. Mm. Yeah. Great. So there is no meat at all in there. No. หน้าตาเหมือนหมูทอดแต่จริงไม่ใช่หมูเพราะว่าอิจิปไม่กินหมูนะฮะหืมกรอบนอกอืมอร่อยอ่ะ Done with chickpeas. อ๋ออืมอันนี้อันนี้คือบาบาคานุชทำมาจากเอ่อ่อยาวเผาหอมมากอืมทั้งหมดนี้เนี่ยไม่มีเนื้อสัตว์เลยแต่ก็มีรสชาตินะเข้มข้นมันแตกต่างกันนึกว่าอันนี้ก็ถั่วอันนี้ก็ถั่วแต่รสคนละรสกันเลยรสชาติกันมิกซ์มาชิโอ้อันนี้ก็เป็นพวกผักยักษ์ไส้นะฮะโอ้ว้าวเป็นข้าวนะครับยักษ์ไส้ลงไปในห่อด้วยใบองุ่นนะฮะใบองุ่นแคบเบจแล้วก็เอ็กแบล Like a zucchini. I make for you the mixed one. Wow. I'm full just looking at all of this. <laughs> We're already up. We're barely started. Yeah, boom, long, nah. Long, long, long. 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 มันเปรี้ยวๆเหมือนมันหมักอะไรทั้งอย่างก็เป็นน้ำส้มน้ำส้มสายชู I think I'll go for the cabbage there we are perfect yep just how I remember it yummy but they normally put the tahini in everything it's like the the Egyptian version of ketchup <laughs> they'll okay. put it. They'll put it in kebabs um, on everything you can imagine. Ah, my God! Pork and lamb. I'm just going to eat the meat. Kosheri. Oh, this is called kosheri, right? Kosheri. Oh. I will mix it for you. Yes. Okay. Mm. 
So, what's in it? Okay. Macaruna. Macaroni. Macaroni. Uh, spaghetti. Spaghetti. Egyptian rice. Egyptian cow Egypt, nah. Yeah. And oh, like lentil. Lentil or yeah. mentua? Yeah. Like a chick, uh, like a chickpeas. Chickpea. Ah. Yeah. And then wow. fried onion. Fried onion. Ah. Uh, wow. Hot, nah. Then you mix together. Special sauce for the kosheri. Special sauce, na kap. Some vinegar. Vinegar. Lemon. Nam som sai chu lemon. Au pet mai? Pet mai? Little bit. Mm. Yeah. Okay. And then mix everything together. ให้ดูถึงที่นะฮะโคชารีนี่เค้าว่าเป็นอ่าอาหารประจําชาติของอียิปต์นะฮะ So normally people eat koshari uh, once a week or something or every day Every day Every day Yes or no You 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 visit it and you know I can't cope with it every day I get this too much but I do love it <laughs> For me I go to Egypt every day If you visit Egypt and you didn't eat the koshari like <laughs> you didn't go. you must There's two there's two types of pasta. <laughs> Three types of lentil. <laughs> All in one dish. It's been a while. I'm looking forward to this. Mm. Yeah. Mm. I, I always go crazy with the fried onion. Mm. The vinegar just helps to kind of loosen everything up and kind of so it's not too stodgy. Mm. There's so much carbs in there, but it's amazing. I love it. Carb is good. Every time, every place you try it, mm -hmm. it's a little bit different. You know, mm -hmm. sometimes people have shorter bits of spaghetti, so that might be why you're thinking in your head Italian. Mm -hmm. But sometimes, you know, it can look completely different. It's always got that those great tastes and great flavors. Mm -hmm. But yeah, I love it. You have to catch it before fly, huh? <laughs> <laughs> it still can fly. <laughs> In Arabic, you can fly. What? What's that? Uh, Swan pistachio. Uh, pistachio. Oh, pistachio. Yeah. Oh. How do we eat it? Uh? <laughs> can you start? Um, I don't know how to start this one. I'm not sure. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to blow. Use your hand. Just <laughs> <laughs> clean it. <laughs> right, I'm not sure. Do we cut? I think. We have four and a half. So, but so it's amazing. That actually looks quite big compared to what I would normally expect. Maybe they they've stuffed it so much that it's. <laughs> you have to eat with your hand. Mm. All right. First, we do like that. Oh, okay, one piece. Then come in the middle. Okay, the best piece for the ladies. Yeah. Piece of the lady? Yeah, okay. the best one. Thank you, ha. What is that? Head? Meat, yes. <laughs> <laughs> and this one. Where? In Egypt, we have two or three kinds to stuff with the pizza. Some stuff rice. Some stuff it with liver, the bitter liver. Oh. We stuff it with, we, we, we fry with onion, with mm. some garlic, with some uh, spices, mm. and then we boil it with the uh, with the rice. Mm. Half boil it, you know, and then we stuff it with with the bitter. All oh, right, and then bitter get uh, fry or no, grill. Bitter we will get the Roast? boil. Uh -huh. Get the boil like forty five minutes uh -huh. with the rice, and then we take it from uh -huh. the water, and then we can fry. And we can do it like barbecue. Oh, and this one? That one is make it with butter. Oh, mix it with butter. Yeah, special 
here we oh. use the butter because you know the oil now everyone you know uh, don't like something uh, fried with a lot of oil oh. that's why we use the butter to fry oh. we're not dipping we're not dipping oh, okay oil. okay not the deep fry if you dip with the oil it's too much oily mm -hmm. that's why we we put a little bit of the butter and then we put the the pigeon and then we try to fry a little bit with the butter oh. we're not dipping with the oil the oh, okay. next step we cannot do like barbecue we take it from the the, the water after the vision boil and then we move to barbecue oh okay with the charcoal okay we, so we you can do it in many ways yeah we will not use in that time we, no, we will not use oil oil or butter and then also we have other other option or other way we can do like a barbecue mm. we not stuff it with with rice oh okay we will bring the vision and then we cut to be uh -huh. open uh -huh. okay and we put in mar in marinade uh, mar uh, one day mm. okay and then we start to do barbecue oh, with okay. the sangria. and that was its different taste so this one is the best way but this one the best way because the rice <laughs> you have to taste the rice with the liver why right? that one the best the best way okay let's try it yeah oh, yes, yes. <laughs> เนื้อนกที่หน้ามันก็ไม่ได้แบบว่าไม่ได้เป็ดขนาดนั้นอ่ะอ่ะพอนกที่หน้ามันจะเป็นเป็ดใช่มั้ยมันจะคล้ายเ
Mm. You have to clean first one, two, four, five, six times mm. with different kind of the, the cleanup. Like we used salt one mm. time, vinegar mm. sometimes. We used like uh, flour sometimes, mm -hmm. and then we leave it one or thirty minutes, one hour or thirty minutes. Some lamb is come like have a smell a little bit, Ooh. but you you have to know how to clean. Ooh. You know you have to you have to know how to work with that. That's why we have a lot of customer come here. You, you need lamb? No, 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 because it's like smelly, you yeah. have a smell. I speak no. Mm -hmm. Don't worry. I will give you the lamb, and then you try it. And oh, he, he shocked about about mm. the, 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 yeah. the smell, about the spices you put inside. I love the flavor of lamb. Mm. Mm. How you like? It? Excellent. It's really excellent. great. You try something like that in Egypt before? No, not whole. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> yeah, not all. Okay. Uh, actually, we sell the lamb like whole lamb if we have some celebration or some. Uh, like a big party? Yeah, big party or birthday or something like that. Mm -hmm. But you have to order from us before one day, oh, at okay. least one or two days. Okay? Uh, but if you like, if you need some other car, if you come two couples or if you come with your friend or the two three person actually it's too much to do for you one yeah. time <laughs> yeah but he can order from the menu uh -huh. or a la carte like uh lamb leg lamb mm -hmm. would call uzi in the menu mm -hmm. uh, it's come like lamb leg lamb uh, lamb leg lamb yes uh, with some rice with some soup uh, but we do it in the different different way. in egypt or the middle east four five six person he can eat especially uh, during ramadan yeah, especially in Ramadan. Yes. Uh, especially yeah. in Ramadan. You eat only at night. Yes, we eat at night. So people, Thai people may wondering, what's the difference between the Middle Eastern food like okay. Egypt and Indian, Indian food? food. Okay. Because most of them think, ah, oh, they are the same thing. Yeah, a lot of spice. Oh, and, uh, yeah, but actually, like, I found it's different. Uh, how, how can you uh, okay. explain it? We, we have to separate between mm -hmm. the Indian food and the Middle East food, and the Egyptian food, mm -hmm. and Lebanese food. Oh, okay. okay. Four different things. Yeah, yeah. For the, the Lebanese, Lebanese food is a different kitchen from the Egyptian. Mm -hmm. Okay. And they put a lot of uh, lemon juice in we, it. We put a lot of lemon, we use the, 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 like, uh, it's different kitchen. Okay, uh -huh. and there's also the, 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 the good food, uh -huh. uh, but it's different kitchen from the Egyptian. Oh, all right. And then if you move from the, from the Egyptian kitchen to Middle East kitchen, the Middle East is like Dubai, Qatar, Oman, Bahrain, uh -huh. Oman. Uh -huh. it is, it's also, it's too much. Different. Oh, okay. Oh. What is the difference? It's different. Okay. The Middle East actually will love it something like that. Uh -huh, like okay. That. Yeah. Something like lamb, like rice, uh -huh. and the curry. Uh -huh. The curry. From Egypt. Okay. Uh -huh. The you know the, the the way cook the chicken or the fish mm. or seafood is different from the from the Egypt. Mm. Okay. Mm. It's, it's, it's different. It's not different much, but a different little bit. Mm -hmm. But if you move to uh, to okay. India, uh -huh. no, we have a lot of change. Huh? The, the spice we, we have a different lot of spice yeah. different spices, uh -huh. Uh -huh. different way to cook, different uh, material from the lamb or chicken, uh, the different rice we use, uh -huh. you know, a lot, a lot of difference oh, okay. between okay. the Indian and the Middle East. This one is the Middle East. Mm -hmm. Okay, but I do it like Egyptian style. Egyptian style. Yeah. Ah. You, you know, I do but Egyptian by the Egyptian style. Okay, the rice. Is the Indian, uh. but the spices, okay, I use in Egyptian way. Egyptian mm -hmm. spices. That's why when you eat, you feel the Egyptian, uh, uh, you know, uh, uh, the Egyptian taste. Yeah. The lamb, that lamb in the Middle East maybe have different ten or fifteen kind of cooking. Uh -huh. How to cook the lamb, you know, have a many kind. How to cook steam, cook with the oven. You know, some sometimes we we put in the lamb and make oh. big. Okay, you, you make a pit. Yes. Ah. Yeah, yeah. It's too, it, many, many different in the Middle East. Uh -huh. But me, I create my own spices. I create my own way to have different way. คือไม่ว่าจะเป็นยังไงก็ตามนะผมคิดว่าเป็นเป็นสไตล์ที่เราต้องค้นหากันต้องลองมาชิมดูว่ามันแตกต่างเป็นยังไงนะฮะแต่
คืออมอาลีซึ่งเราอยากจะรู้ว่ามันอมอะไรนะฮะอมอาลีนะฮะคือก่อนที่เราจะมานะก็ทางร้านก็บอกว่าถ้าสนใจนะครับก็ติดตาม Facebook Fanpage ได้นะครับก็ชื่อว่า a r a b e s b a n g k o k นะครับ Instagram ก็ a r a b e s b a n g k o k เหมือนกันนะฮะไลน์แอปนะครับติดต่อได้นะก็เป็นเพื่อนกันก็คือ a r a b e s b k k นะครับแล้วก็ถ้าจะจองสำรองที่นั่งนะครับก็ติดต่อมาที่เบอร์02 656 9440นะครับ02 656 9440นะครับก็ติดต่อมาจองโต๊ะกันได้นะฮะถ้าใจให้ดีนะก็มาวันที่เชฟอยู่ด้วยก็ดีนะได้เชฟมาเล่าให้ฟังกันแต่ละจานแต่ละจานสำหรับมูมามูเป็นคนจริงๆแล้วมูไม่ชอบทานถั่วไม่ชอบทานสไปซ์แบบกินเครื่องเทศอะไรเงี้ยเยอะๆไม่ชอบทานสไปซ์ก็กินโคลาไม่ใช่ไม่ใช่สไปซ์แบบเครื่องเทศอะไรเงี้ยเยอะๆบุมเอาจริงๆไม่ชอบแต่พอมาร้านนี้แล้วแบบอเมซิ่งมากเพราะว่าไม่คิดว่ามันจะทานได้ง่ายขนาดเนี้ยแล้วมันแบบทุกอย่างมันลงตัวมันแบบมันไม่ได้โดดไม่ได้มีกินอะไรขนาดนั้นอินเดียใช่ไหมใช่มันทานง่ายกว่าที่เคยได้มาแต่ร้านนี้ใครชอบอาหารอินเดียเขาก็มีนะใช่ค่ะอาหารอาหรับเนี่ยที่ผมเคยไปทานที่ทางดูไบทางสหรัฐอาหรับอเมริกาเนี่ยผมก็ยอมรับว่าอาหารอาหรับรสชาติจะอ่อนกว่าอาหารอินเดียนะกินง่ายกว่านะครับค่ะ Are you enjoy the food so far? It's been great, yeah. yeah. It feels like um, but being back in Egypt, which is great. If you want the taste of Egypt and the Middle East, mm-hmm. come over and try some of this amazing food. And mention Jin Tam Lung, and you get 50 f i f t f i f t f i f t f i f t f i f t f i f Yes, Om Wali. Om Wali. Wow, <laughs> food on the fire. Oh, <laughs> food on the fire. Not like the last one. Come on, Om Wali. Okay. That's you. Mm-hmm. This is coconut. This is coconut powder. Oh. Okay. Aya. <laughs> Watch your sleeve. <laughs> like a pancake. <laughs> so what is that one? What so is this one? We call kunafa. Kunafa. Mm-hmm. Yes. What is it made of? Make of uh, cheese. Cheese. Okay. Cheese? It's stuffed with the noodles. Oh, ah. I like the noodles, but in Egyptian way. Oh, 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 ขนมปังนะขนมปังกับเบรดนะคะโซสเซอร์พุดดิ้งนะ with milk with cream with honey with well caramel flavor flour flour yes like a honey toast อ่ะ let really it tastes like honey toast คล้ายๆแต่ว่ามันมันนิ่มๆอ่ะ honey toast มันจะเหมือนอันนี้มันนุ่มมันใส่ทุกอย่างลงไปของจานนี้ขนมปังคุ้มค่าโอ้อร่อยไหมอร่อยค่ะ This is one of my favorites. Really? It reminds me a lot of a dessert we have in in the UK called bread and butter pudding. Oh. It's not it's not done in the same way at all, but it's got got a lot of the same creamy caramel caramel kind of flavors. The Kun Thai shop mark there. Jin Jin. Yes. Hmm. I'm honestly not a dessert kind of person. I don't normally go for desserts, but this, wow. อันนี้เหมือนเหมือนอาหารฝรั่งนะหอมอืมอาหารฝรั่งเส้นหมี่ทอดเส้นหมี่ใช่โรยด้วยพิตาชิโอใช่แปลกอืมไม่เคยว่ามันจะรสแบบนี้ไม่เคยว่าแบบนี้ But you guys not sure So funny t e s t Really? It's weird. Om Ali, นะฮะมาถึงต้องสั่งนะฮะจะได้รู้ว่ามันอมอะไร Om Ali. 
วันนี้นะครับก็อิ่มอร่อยไปกับอาหารอียิปต์นะครับเป็นไงฮะรสชาติอร่อยมากค่ะทานง่ายมากๆเลยะนะเป็นอาหารที่แปลกน่าสนใจนะครับวันนี้ก็ต้องขอขอบคุณนะครับเชฟแซมมากนะครับที่แนะนําอาหารแปลกๆให้เราชิมในวันนี้จัดพิเศษเต็มที่ใช่ใช่แล้ววันนี้เชฟมีอะไรบางอย่างจะบอกกับท่านผู้ชมด้วยครับ Come to Arab Bistro Restaurant, Sukum Vid Sai Tu. You can get 15% discount if you mention. กินตามลุงโอเคมาลองชิมกันให้ได้นะครับที่ร้านอาราเบสนะครับสุขุมวิทซอย2นะครับขับลงมาเนี่ยเกือบสุดซอยแล้วประมาณ 3-400 เมตรนะร้านอยู่ทางขวามือนะครับอร่อยมากครับโทรมาจองด้วยนะครับสำหรับวันนี้ไปก่อนครับบ๊ายบาย